can be 2017 problem number one. Harry thought of a positive two digit number. She multiplied it by three and added 11. Then she switched the digit of the result, obtaining a number below 71 and between 71 and 75 inclusive. What is Mary's number? Well, what are the choices? A, 11, B, 12, C, 13, D, 14, and E, 15. When I first approached this problem and uh, on my AMC, I was like, no time for thinking, gotta go. So I just plugged in all the answers one by one into this algorithm and picked whichever one was correct. However, there's actually a faster way. What is it? Well, first of all, we're taking uh, the number, multiplying it by three and adding 11. So that expression would be three x plus 11. And then she switched the digit of the result, obtaining a number between 71 and 75 inclusive. So every number between 71 and 75, you may notice, has the first digit of seven. So that means that the last digit of three x plus 11, since they get reversed, must be seven. Last digit is seven. But the thing is, there's more. What is three x's last digit? Well, the thing is, if you take any number that ends with seven, and then you subtract 11 from it, it will always give you a number whose last digit is six. So that means that if we subtract 11 from here, giving us three X, then three X's last digit is six. Because, write this down, um, a number ending with seven minus 11 will always equal a number ending in six. All right. So now, which one of these applies to, so which one of these choices applies to this scenario? Well, three, 11 times three is 33. So A is out of the question. 13 times three is 39. So C's out of the question. 14 times three is 42. So D's out of the question. And E is 15 times three, which is 45, which is also out of the question. Only B remains. 12 times three is 36. And indeed, we can confirm that this does work because what is 12 times three? 36, yeah. 36 plus 11, mosquito season. 47, and then we have 47 swapped around to give 74. So that means that B, 12, must be the answer. Thank you everybody for watching.